There are few things in our universe as perplexing, complicated and downright terrifying as a black hole. You've heard of black holes in numerous science fiction books and movies, but have you ever truly understood one and have you ever seen one? Thanks to some amazing work by the brilliant minds at NASA, we have now actually gotten a glimpse of a black hole and it's every bit as dark and haunting as you'd expect. In this video, we're going to take a look at NASA's first ever image of a real black hole. You'll find out just how powerful this cosmic phenomenon really is. And also, what would happen if a black hole entered our solar system? A black hole is a portion of space in which gravity is so intensely strong that not even light can escape from it. Because the matter has been crammed into such a small space, gravity is extremely powerful. Now, it's a fact that you've never seen a black hole yourself because, well, it's actually impossible. People cannot see black holes because no light can escape them. They are essentially undetectable. Space telescopes equipped with specialized equipment can aid in the discovery of black holes, but even that is an incredibly difficult task for even the most advanced technology. Special instruments can see how stars in close proximity to black holes behave differently from other nearby stars. Stellar black holes, which are those that have masses up to 20 times more than our Sun, are formed when the core of a massive star collapses in on itself. When this happens, a supernova occurs. A supernova is a star that explodes and sends a portion of its mass into space. Supermassive black holes, according to scientists, were created at the same time as the galaxy in which they reside. As you can tell, black holes are profoundly complicated and intricate objects in space and require a lot of studying. NASA has been studying them for years now, and yet truly learning about black holes has never gotten easier for the mere fact that no sort of instruments could get even remotely close to them because of their distance from Earth. Until recently, getting a shot of a black hole has always been downright impossible. Now, NASA has gotten a good look at a black hole, and achieving such a goal was no small feat. The image depicts the shadow cast by the supermassive black hole at the center of Messier 87, or M87, an elliptical galaxy 55 million light years from Earth. This black hole has a mass that is 6.5 billion times that of our massive Sun. To snap this shot, eight ground-based radio telescopes across the world worked in tandem as if they were one giant telescope the size of our entire planet to catch its shadow. The Event Horizon Telescope EHT, is an international network of radio telescopes in Chile, Mexico, Spain, Hawaii, Arizona and the Antarctic that has been working for years to gain a good look at a black hole using a totally new approach. In addition to the EHT results, Numerous NASA satellites were part of a broad effort to observe the black hole using other wavelengths of light, which was coordinated by the EHT's multi-wavelength working group. The Chandra X-ray Observatory, Nuclear Spectroscopic Telescope Array and Neil Gurl Swift Observatory Space Telescope projects, all of which are sensitive to distinct types of X-ray light, pointed their telescopes at the M87 black hole around the same time as the EHT in April 2017. During the EHT observations, NASA's Fermi Gamma Ray Space Telescope was also looking for changes in gamma ray emission from M87. Data from these missions and other telescopes may be used to help figure out what was going on if EHT detected changes in the structure of the black hole's environment. While staring at M87's black hole, the global team collected more than a petabyte of data using this collaborative effort. It took scientists two years to put together the snapshot we have today, our first actual look at a black hole. We need to learn a lot about black holes, and especially supermassive black holes, 
which have masses that are more than one million suns together. Scientists have determined that each large galaxy contains a supermassive black hole at its center. The one at the center of the Milky Way is called Sagittarius A, and it has a mass equal to four million suns. As you can imagine, a black hole of that size would do a lot of damage to Earth and everything around it. In fact, we wouldn't stand a chance if a black hole decided to get close to us. But will that ever happen? Should we be staying awake at night worried that we are about to be swallowed whole by one of these monstrous deep space enigmas? By blind luck alone, it's very unlikely that Earth will ever come even remotely close to a black hole. The black hole at the center of our Milky Way is 26,000 light years away. So, even if it was chomping up planets right now, we wouldn't even notice. But it's not. In fact, scientists think it's actually not affecting the planets or stars surrounding it. Remember, a black hole, like a star, is a concentration of mass that other things orbit around. So, there's a chance that a galaxy could continue like normal with a black hole in it. However, a supermassive black hole would be a whole different story, but it needs a galaxy much bigger than ours to thrive, eat and grow. So, we are safe from black holes and supermassive black holes, at least for now. Our closest spiral galaxy, named Andromeda, already has two supermassive black holes in it. The galaxy is flying towards it at an astonishing 110 kilometers per second. And when it finally smashes into the Milky Way, there is a chance that they will become one black hole that would be 100 million times larger than the mass of the Sun. When that happens, the chances of everything around the black hole, including our galaxy, will likely be completely consumed. The sheer mass and strength of it will essentially crush everything and all forms of matter. But of course, that's four billion years from now, so you and everyone you know are safe from this catastrophe that awaits far, far in the future. And keep in mind, our sun is set to explode in about 5 billion years, so our galaxy will be in its twilight years at that point anyway. The truth is that black holes are mysterious, dangerous, and still one of the biggest question marks floating through the stars. We may not know everything there is to know about them yet, but one thing is for sure, we don't have to worry about them coming close in the near future. Thanks for watching another episode of Voyager. And while you're still here, go ahead, click the video on your screen for more amazing content about space. I'll see you there.